Well, hello, ladies, gentlemen, and everyone watching. I'm your host, the Report of the Week, and I want to give you this little bit of an update uh, in regards to how I am doing. <laughs> One thing that you might notice right off the bat is that I'm talking a little funny. <laughs> That's because I had two teeth removed uh, very, very recently, uh, just a couple days ago, really. I was, uh, if you saw, I did a video uh, a couple days back saying how uh, I had these two molars that had this bad dental work done and whatnot. Well, they got pulled out. Now my, even if you can't tell, <laughs> I'm a little swollen and I uh, can't talk perfectly. There is some pain, but overall, everything is going good. I know it must kind of be comical to uh, hear me talking in this way, but it'll, it'll get better soon, I promise you there. Uh, but Here's what I have to say in regards to the procedure to do a little bit of a, uh, I don't know, what, what do you call it, a dental, oral surgery review? Here's what we got. I, I was so nervous beforehand, let me just say that. I was so nervous. I was just, I mean, really bad anxiety. You know, I have this dental anxiety. Imagine having that just, you know, for like a cavity or something. Now I have to get two teeth pulled, forget it. So I had all this anxiety beforehand. I was gonna get put under, uh, with, you know, the strong anesthesia. And it was just, you know, all these what-ifs. I've, I've never had it done before. I've never, you know, what's gonna happen? What if it all goes wrong? Um, what if I remember everything? Is there gonna be a lot of pain? What about the aftercare? What about dry socket? All this stuff, you know, it's like, what's gonna happen? And the day of, I figure, well, we just gotta bite the bullet. Nothing I can really do. Go over there, get it done. Let me just say first and foremost, if you're getting anesthesia, say general anesthesia, or even IV sedation, you have nothing to worry about. Uh, my experience with that was, it's almost indescribable, it was like, you know, I go there to get the two teeth pulled out, I just didn't really want to be awake, I didn't want to be conscious for it, it was just because I was so, I was so nervous about it, you know, it was like, I didn't want to feel them rooting around in there and pulling this stuff out, you know, was, so what they did was, uh, I was talking with the doctor and the nurses that were there, went to an oral surgeon, and you can kind of actually see in my arm, not really, but right there, it's where they hooked the uh, IV up. They said, all right, you know, if need needles bother you, this is gonna be the worst part. They put it in, and uh, all right, you know, so for a minute, I just say, all right, you know, we're just, we're getting everything ready. I uh, just, you know, I'm, I'm talking to one of the people there about the YouTube, believe it or not. And, uh, so, you know, I'm sitting there, I'm talking to them, I'm saying, yeah, you know, I do the videos, uh, you know, a couple times a week, and then the next thing I know, someone's hand is in my mouth, putting, putting gauze in, and it's over. A and it was like, the way people describe it, it's always the same. But the way, like, some anesthesia, especially the stronger types, it's crazy, it's it's not like I'm just talking and oh, I'm feeling a little sleepy and my eyes just start slowly closing and you know, it all fades to black. It wasn't like that. And it wasn't like I'm feeling dizzy, you know, I'm, I'm seeing the light at the end of the tunnel or any of that stuff. It was like, I'm talking to them about the YouTube and it was like a jump cut, you know, like you see a jump cut in a video, it's just from one moment to the next, instantaneous, no transition, absolutely nothing. That's what it was like. One minute I'm talking to them, the next, everything is over, I'm patched up, they're putting some gauze in, and that's it. No recollection whatsoever. I didn't wake up, I didn't feel a single thing, I mean, it was smooth as possible. I mean, just as smooth as can be. I mean, I, 
I gotta give them credit, it did its job. It wasn't a bad experience. Look, I didn't look forward to getting this stuff done. The recovery is what it is. Procedure itself was absolutely flawless. Uh, out of 10, easily, easily a nine out of 10, uh, I, would, I would rate them being. Because uh, again, smooth procedure. It got rid of my fears, got rid of my anxieties, got rid of my worries. Didn't feel anything, no pain, it's done very good. So, uh, the, the extractions themselves went uh, by very, very smoothly. Uh, so far, these next couple of days, you know, it's just been... You just gotta manage things, that's what it comes down to. You gotta manage the pain, you gotta do it responsibly, number one. Uh, number two, gotta watch your diet, right? You have right now this swelling in the jaw, in the gums, which is why I kinda sound a little weird talking. It'll get better, though, I promise, and I can still articulate myself. Um, you know, you just have to be very careful. You don't want to get the dry socket. You don't want the, you know, everything that they've done because they uh, took the teeth out and they filled the socket with um, bone-like materials, a bone graft. So then when I get the implants going forward, you know, they'll have something to hook it into and um, get the new teeth put in, right? So as a result, um, because of all that, you don't want that to be disturbed, you don't want everything to fall out, right? You don't want to have that all undone, you just got to be careful. I mean, I'm probably talking a little too much uh, as it is. I think it'll be okay, though. It's been three days. Just can't use the straws, that's a little... I like my straws. Um, just can't avoid... Well, you have to avoid some of the real solid foods. No chips, no popcorns, you know, none of that stuff just yet. Mostly been... Feasting on jello, um, pudding, soups, baby food, um, healthy little nutritional supplement drinks, uh, etc. And, uh, eh, you know, of course, I want to I want to eat a pizza, you know, I want to have some nice burgers or something, but, hey, you know what, it's all right. Not the end of the world, and, uh, last thing I want is to just rush things and, uh, you know, get into it, and then reset everything by a couple weeks and uh, mess it all up because I wanted to get that pizza a little too quick so the most frustrating thing is just trying to you know maintain a certain diet which is it's totally doable though and um, otherwise everything is going smooth you know you stay active you stay healthy and uh, you gotta rinse it out with some salt water here and there you know you gotta brush the teeth around it so you just gotta take care of yourself which if you're able to do that, you'll recover just fine, and, uh, just got to take it easy for a little bit, really. But, all in all, it's been a really smooth process. Um, smooth recovery so far. Fingers crossed that it stays that way. I'll keep you guys posted going forward, and, uh, in the meantime, I just want to let everyone know that I'm alive, that I'm well, that I'm doing good, and, uh, that the procedure to get these teeth taken out was a success, and I'm um, not in any sort of excruciating pain. Everything is being managed accordingly, and uh, yeah, really smooth. It was a job done, um, no doubt, by professionals. They did a, they did a great job, and uh, great success right there. So, very happy with that. Wanted to keep everyone updated. Also, uh, I really want to thank you all for the support that's come in. It's it's so crazy every time. And I know it almost feels silly, like, back in November, you know, I had my accident. And it feels like here I am again, down for the count a little bit. I, it just seems a little silly, like, it's just one after the next. Hopefully I'll, uh, hopefully this will be it for a while. Um, but I just want to thank you all so much for your support. Just again, seeing the messages, seeing the emails, seeing all the comments, it, it just, it blows me away. Thank you so much to everyone out there who's uh, just been wishing me a, a smooth and successful recovery. So far, it has been. Just going to take a little, you know, take it easy with the food reviews and whatnot for a bit. But once I can use the straws again, maybe I'll do some smoothie reviews, you name it. <laughs> but uh, just thank you all so much for your support. It means so much to me. I really, really appreciate it, so thank you. So yeah, on a, uh, on a final note, I just had to get some water, and uh, then by the time I got that, I usually have it here, I've forgotten. <laughs> then I had to reset the camera a little bit. 
Um, but yeah, on a final note, everything seems to have went good. Everything seems to have went smooth. And uh, yeah, hopefully it'll stay that way. Hopefully things will just be on the up and up. Hopefully the uh, swelling will go down a little bit soon. And uh, then I'll be able to sound a little more normal, talk with a little more ease. And uh, in the meantime, just taking it easy. But yeah, I'll be keeping you guys posted. Uh, thank you, though, for your understanding. In the meantime, while I just kind of give my teeth a little bit of a break, I'm going to get a lot of fun videos out. I'm going to try some different things and just have a, you know, have a good time. Make the most of it. Make the best of it, right? So uh, that's what the plan is looking like. And uh, interestingly enough, got some interesting stuff in the mail. Might want to do a little bit of an unboxing type of video going forward. We'll see. And, uh, yeah, maybe some just other types of, uh, review videos, miscellaneous talk. It's just gonna be fun. Give it a shot, give it a chance. And, uh, yeah, just wanted to keep you posted on how things went. But look, lastly, anyone has any dental work coming up, I know that some dentists are better than others. I know that some doctors are better than others. Look, I mean, in 2016, I had a run-in with a really bad one. But just know this check the reviews see what people are saying if you go to a good doctor it's going to be a breeze trust me there a lot of us have dental anxiety i do but this procedure is something i was worried so much about when the time actually came i was nervous about the anesthesia i was worried about the process the aftercare it goes by so quick so flawlessly there's things that make it better. And, you know, if you just give yourself a little bit of a break, give your mouth, just take it easy, eat some soft foods, you know, some smoothies, you know, you name it. It's all going to be good, and I promise you there. So, everything's going good. Everything's going all right. Just want to keep you guys updated, and uh, I'll see you again in a couple days with another video. Thank you, and take care. I'm your host, the Report of the Week, with a dental update and a surgery review. Thank you.